Hello my friends, my name is Baiano with Baiano Renault. In this video I'm gonna show you how to do a corner inside corner use a dry old paper tape. Nice and easy, just the fiber tape. I'll show you guys. Okay, let's work. Yes, is this a recording? Okay, like you guys can see. On this side you have a little bit of a ridge in there. This is the inside side that goes to the drywall. I just gonna flip it over. You see we have an indent. This is great for the corner because all you do, you're just gonna bend. Just like that. And then we make the corner. We're just gonna tape the inside corner, a few inside corners just to show you guys. This is our hand tape. Okay, for this one, I can use a hook, like you guys can see, and a 4 inches knife. The mud I'm just uh, using a, a tape compound. Like you guys can see, it's not too hard. We mix a few liters of water on the full box. But it's uh, hard enough because uh, once we're doing it by hand, it's going to be a little bit harder. Alright? So, just, I grab a bit of mud and I'm just gonna, I just not gonna put too much mud. Mud would hold good. So I'm just gonna go one side. Okay. Very much I run halfway and then I go down. Another side. Here I have a little hole. I just gonna put a little bit mud before I go just to make sure we have mud inside. And then I just go the same way. Halfway and then I fill in a bit more. Go the other way. Like if you have a little bit miss mud, we just load a bit more. Nice and easy. So this corner is load. I'm gonna load the other corner here. Okay, like you guys can see, I'm just gonna go low just to show you guys what happened here. See, I load the knife like that, like you guys can see. I start with the knife, you see the inclination of the knife. Maybe I gonna do from the bottom, that way you guys can see better. Look this. You see the inclination of my knife. By the time I finish with the mud, the knife is very much going flat with the drywall. See? This is the way you leave uh, enough mud. I just have my tape, like you see, I just do like this. Doesn't matter which way you go, up or down. I'm just gonna put the tape, make sure that it is nice and square. Like you guys can see. Just make sure, and then I'm just gonna cut. Not gonna go all the way down because the tape get a mess and this one the baseboard would cover it. And I just, if you have doubt, just do something like that. The tape gonna be nice and square. And then there's no problem, like I can load it, it can stay there for a few minutes. And then the third one, the same way. I just gonna pull it up, push it in. Like not into place, like uh, go down, and then I just gonna see. I just put it like that and pull it on the tape like this. Okay, like when, when you're cleaning, you just go from the center, right? Just, as you can see. Go 
the end you just can uh, you guys can just go with the tape the knife like this Nothing to it guys, like you guys can see, tape is on, nice and clean, make sure you leave a little bit more than you need it, see like not too much, enough to hold the tape, this other corner the same way, just run your knife, 4 inches knife, nice and good. So if you situation like that, you guys just can clean it this way. Just make sure you have it clean all the way down. Just make sure your corner is nice and square. If you guys run the knife like stand like this, you guys can see the corner of the knife make the corner it's straight, if you hold the knife is straight and the square level, you're gonna have a nice square corner. Okay my friends, thank you for watching this video. I love you guys. Thank you for your support. Yes, if you have any question how to do inside corner tape, leave your comment or your question. And we will answer you right away. Thank you very much for watching this video. I love you guys. See you soon.